Good morning everybody, this is Rhythm Stick Drumming's Bucket Drumming Class live on Zoom and today we are doing a bit of D-Light. 1990. Groove is in the heart. So what we're going to do is we're going to do three complementary groove patterns because a lot of the songs just boom, gatch, boom, gatch. We'll get a little bit bored if we do that all the way through. So we've got, if you think about your main pulses here, we're going to add one in the middle, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. If you're right-handed, I'd recommend this way, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Now, if you've got quite nice grip on your stick, so you've got a nice flexible grip, you should be able to get some double notes. Like this. So a double is just where you play a pair of notes on one hand. So we could go left, double, left, double, left, double, left, double. Problem is, it's about that tempo. So that might be a bit fast for some of you to do doubles all the time, but you could throw in a double occasionally. So that's every four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Or you could do every two. Or every eight. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, one, two. Just quite a nice thing to throw in. Or all the time, if you've got a nice relaxed grip on your right hand. Okay. Um, if you're drumming on a pillow, you won't be able to drum fast enough. You do need something with a decent rebound. And the best thing in my room to rebound on is actually, it's actually a worktop. So if you're practicing uh, a wooden block, put on a table or the table itself if you're not too precious about it and um, it's harder for me to do it in the middle of my bucket because it's not got as good a rebound but the edge of my bucket is harder and that seems to work I bought some new buckets over there I've gone all bucket excited so the room's in a bit of chaos at the moment so excuse the mess um, oh and it's been Valentine's Day look we're a perfect pair apparently uh, right so that is those are the that's the main pattern we're going to use or okay now we're also going to switch to getting some stick practice in of doing our what i call a hi-hat pattern um in a song like this the drummer wouldn't actually switch between these patterns we're just doing it as a nice exercise because the pattern in here is really simple um so you get your hi-hats going so this is where you've got your symbols over on the right hand side for um uh we go ch -ch 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 -ch, like my hi-hat impression so you're going to keep a nice pulse and you're going to go middle, middle. Make sure you're going both. Both right, right, right. Both right, right, right. You're not going left, right, right, right. Left, right, right. It's both. Now we're going to do a rim note as well. Middle, edge, middle, edge. If this is something you've not done before, I'd recommend practicing it really slowly. Something you can just do on your own, even with your hands if you don't have any drumsticks. But we're going to be cracking on at more like the speed. Probably about that. So we're going to switch between pattern one, the basic pattern, then throwing in some doubles. And then I'll also, if we've had a break, we'll start coming with a hi hat. And then go middle, edge, middle, edge, middle, edge. There's a couple more patterns for us to look at. The first one is we're going to play the bongo pattern, which is in the very beginning, and it goes da, 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 do, da, 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 do. Let me just slow that down. Edge, 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 middle, edge, 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 middle. Faster. 
So we'll do this at the beginning of the song. Then we'll do a stop. Then we'll do the main pattern. Or some doubles. There's quite a few stops in the song. Other than that, the only main bit to learn is the bridge section, which sounds quite different. Let me play that for you. Okay, here's the bridge. I think it might be me, Eleanor. I think my audio is going a bit funny. So we've got... Well, the section's finished now, so let's stop it. If we take out one note, makes it a bit easier. Or we put it back in. That's our bridge section. There is one more bit to look at, which is got a click on it. It goes wait, click, wait, click. Three, boo! So you've got wait, click, wait, click, one, two, three, boo! And then it's not as easy when you've got big um, noise, um, big E Defender headphones on for drumming, so I don't damage my hearing. Um, so yeah, wait, click, wait, click, one, two, three, boo! Or one, two, three, four. Then after that, we come in with the bridge pattern, if I remember to tell you. At the end, there is a little bit where we go one, two, three, four. I'll just call it four stabs and I'll call that in for you. I think we're ready. Hopefully my audio will hold out. Maybe it just doesn't like delight. Da, 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 do, da, 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 do, three, four. Basic pattern. After four, let's switch to the doubles. Two, three, four, double. Now try doubles every two. Back in, we're going to get the hi hats ready. Bongo, 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 bongo. Two, three, hi hats. Then middle edge, three, four. And the tick, we're going to do a stop and then go into the bridge. Is the boom, ka, ka, boom, boom, ka, boom. Up. Bridge, two, three, go. They stop, they jump on me. After four. We're going to go back into the basic pattern, which is left, right, left, right. One, two, three, go! Let's 
Okay, we've got the clicks coming. Wait, click, wait, click. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, boom, bridge. After four, we're going to do four stabs, then go back into our basic pattern. Up, two, three, four. Go. Okay, add some doubles in. After four, we stop. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Come on, y'all two. Y'all are crazy, man. Not again. Not a second time. It's crazy enough the first time. Great suggestion, Eleanor. Strangely, all the females in the group knew the song. Um, nearly Most of the males or nearly all the males didn't know the song. Just not implying taste based on gender or anything there. Cool. All right. <laughs> Have a good day. See you later, guys.